going to be my review on the Sugar Trip Collection. Here's one of the products. Anyways, if you want to see more, please stay tuned. Hey guys, so today is a bit more god mode. Anyways, I'm testing out the... I never knew, was it NYX or NYX? I'm no, I've never been sure. Um, anyways, I tested out some stuff from their collection. This is what I was able to pick up. Uh, it's about 50 bucks worth of stuff. I really didn't have a lot of money, but I tried to pick up some of the items. And this one is Licorice Lane. I'm gonna try all these on. Let's see what the colors look like. This could go really well or really bad. And let's see what the formula looks like at all. But, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and get this open. like uh liquid that's uh, that uh, I'll put it on my actual lips too let me take off my lip gloss because that'd probably help me out a lot right now I'm gonna try this on I don't I only have my mirror behind me so hopefully I can still see what I'm doing this is like blinding me okay let's try this one it's all right it's a little bit dry, but I mean, it's matte. It's supposed to be dry, so it's not overly dry. It's dry compared to the gloss, which is what I normally use. No, it actually applies really nicely. I keep getting it everywhere. Anyways, that's that red color. God, I wish, I wish I knew what it was called. I, it probably does have a name, but I'm just like totally not saying it. Yeah, all I see is the Gersh Lane. Oh, Vine Vibes. Yeah, see? I knew that. It says it like on the back. So this is the Vine Vibes. That's how that one looks. Um, I gotta go take it off to this one. take it off. I want to do like a smoke test, but obviously I'm not going to like smoke on the camera, so I'm going to do like this and just see that's how much it transfers. So just to give you guys an idea. So this next one here is Sweet Surrender. It's like a brown color. I think there's two browns. I think this one's like a reddish brown and the other one's like a dark brown. It looks a little... Can you guys see that? My camera is not gonna pop. Can you guys? You can kind of see it. I kind of scuffed looking. Anyway, I'm gonna swatch it right here. You guys can see. Oh, you can see. It's ready for. That's how that one looks. Same thing. Try it on.
this one is the sour grapes. It's so Whoa. Is it just me or is that like the same color? Hmm. I don't know. I'm gonna put it on my lips because it takes too long to do a couple things, so I'll be back. This is the sour grapes shade that I just swatched. Uh, this is how this one looks. It actually, it is kind of a different color. I don't know if it's gonna pick up on the camera, but this is like a really like vampy kind of red. Like, which would make sense, because like wine. Um, yeah, so that's this one. Uh, the next one is a black color. I don't know if it's for the Licorice Lane set. And yeah, I think it's the next one. So my lips are looking rough. But the last one in this set is Heart of Cold. This is probably gonna be my favorite. I hope the black is nice. Um, same thing. I don't think that's anything to do with them. I think that's just how packaging is. That happens sometimes. And, oh, I want you guys to be able to see this one too. So that's that one. So those are all three of the colors. I'm gonna put it on, come back, make you continue and show you guys what it looks like. This is the Heart of Coal one. I don't know, I like it. It's, it's a little intense. But I think with the right eye makeup, this would look really nice. Or you could just do an overall minimal look like this and just stay done. This is the Heart of Coal. This is what it looks like. Um, it's a little bit harder to apply than the other three, but it's nice for me. It's smooth. Like, I do not feel like it's drying to my lips at all. Like, it's, it's nice. And it, it says matte, but there is a sheen. If you guys can see that. Anyways, I don't know. I might leave this one. showing you a view on is this one which is the land of lollies there's water on it currently so now for their little eye set this is the land of lollies eyeshadow set eyeshadow palette and okay it's got like this on the back and what that's saying right here and what that's saying is some of them are pressed pigments, and I guess some of them are not. It's kind of confusing. Anyways, I don't know how I'm going to say the name of these, because I don't see a name on any of these. So I'm just going to do it going by. I'm going to do like a um, full eyeshadow for each one, and I still got to adjust my brightness on this. Full eyeshadow on each one. Actually, some of these are real. Okay. Matte, glitter, 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 glitter. I guess two of them are matte. The white is matte and the black is matte. And I say, I'm going to start with the white. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm putting my brush in it. And then I'm just going to put it straight across my skin. It's, it's decent. Like, keep in mind, I have like no primer or nothing. It's just bare skin. So... There you go. Now you, that's like how it actually looks. Okay. I'm gonna do each shade. Oh, no, I'll put the color on my camera too. So, going into it, swatching. That one isn't showing up as much. You can see a little bit of a shed. But again, keep in mind, there's no problem, there's no nothing on that. I'm just doing a favor. No, it's kind of hard to show up. Maybe it's like, I think this is one of their best ones. Maybe if you apply it wet, it'll be better. Which actually, I'm going to do a test. Let's see how that applies wet, I'll be right back. Apply it with a different brush. I'm using this one, just because it's like, something. Too much. 
just like as little water as possible just to see how they do. And then I'm gonna still see that see. I don't want it to be too wet. decently bright. And then, here I'm just gonna put it completely over top and then just pigment and see how that color looks. The brush is too damn big to be. It blends out pretty easily too, that's nice. Um, I'm gonna do a different color on the other eye, just that way I can get all this stuff. take these off and then get back to this so I can do more colors for those with the dry rag. Anyways, next is that there's like a navy blue color. So I'm gonna be doing that one. Seeing how that looks and then applying dry. If I do a finger swatch, does it come out longer? It actually, it looks a different color from when I swatch it from a brush to my finger. Let me try applying this shadow with my finger then. See how that does. It's alright. Let me try it with my brush now. nice. That's what it looks like. That's actually really pretty. I like it. That's like a nice like starry kind of shade. The next one is the pink. So um, I'm trying to wipe off my brush into a peach color. crazy. Um, hmm. I'm going to do the purple, but I'm going to take this off because it's too much now. The next one I'm going to apply is that purple, which is right here. Um, so, okay, that's an extremely accurate representation of the color right there. So the next one is that purple. actually really pretty. Um, God, if I can get it to pick up. It's not going to. Anyways, I'm going to put it on my eyes. Can you guys see how it's like shimmery? Okay, yeah. This is actually, I know I realize I'm saying that a lot. It's actually a pretty color, but I'm pleasantly surprised by this palette. So yeah. Okay, that's that color. Next one is the 
tealy kind of color. I'm gonna put my brush into it, and I guess that's that color. And my color, I cannot see. I'm literally doing blind in this light. I'm sorry. To burn better makeup. I am. I'm just gonna come. Let me do this off camera because I just cannot see that eye. You guys to see this, I went to blend and it got absolutely everywhere. I'm gonna clean that off, but I'll show you guys what it looks like. Obviously this is what it looks like, but give me a sec. That is the black pigment, that's the gold, and that's the black. And that's what they look like. And this palette was called The Land of Lollies. I've got lip stuff on here, so I'm confused. No, I guess it's both. Anyways, that's that one. Um, that's it for now. Once I get more products, I'll add more to the video, hopefully. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, even though I look bad shit crazy. show you guys this one first before I get into this is the eye set but anyways this one right here it says illuminating powder and it's got like the cutest packaging like that's adorable is it not and it says powdered sugar I'm assuming that's the color it's actually really adorable like I like this a lot um let me open it off camera so I don't look like a fool and then once I get it open I'll show you guys what the actual formula looks like and all that this is the actual thing. I have not opened it yet. I'm about to crack it open because I think that's like satisfying opening the makeup. Apparently, I'm just not satisfying it. Really. This one looks like in the back is cute too. Look at that. So yeah, I'm assuming this is powdered sugar. Um, I'm gonna put it on. Actually, no. I'm gonna turn down my brightness and then put this on so you guys can see what it really looks like. Okay, so I'm using a paintbrush because it's like literally all I've got. Oh, that's nice. I like that a lot. That's actually really pigmented. You know what? I'm not even mad. I'm not wearing foundation right now either. I should mention that because I figured if I'm going to do all the lip stuff, I'm just going to be wiping it all off. Might as well be not wearing foundation.
guys might enjoy that. Anyways, that's these three products. It is nowhere near the whole collection, but I figured I'd give you guys a brief rundown at least. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe,